Josh Spryder was talking to those anti-Trump folks today. And Josh, what did you hear? You know, Brandon, it was uh, definitely a different scene, just steps away from all of those people in line. People began getting in line to protest against Trump early this morning. We're going to show you some video now uh, from 1130 this morning. This was the scene as Trump protesters were starting to meet. And even though there were only a few dozen protesters outside, those protesting told WOWT 6 News that the number doesn't matter. They said it's important to not be a bystander and sit back and watch things happen in our country that you may not personally believe in. Protesters told us it's important to get your voice heard no matter what. And they also all had different reasons about why they were here to rally against Donald Trump. I'm here um, protesting Donald Trump's presidency. I feel it would be really bad for the country. It's especially bad for anybody who's not a white rich man who doesn't pay his taxes. I watched the debate. I was horrified by his uh, performance and I was really impressed with Hillary, although I wasn't much of a Hillary supporter before then. And back out here live, we're actually told by police and security that they actually place those protesters back a little bit farther than they have in the past to try and avoid any confrontations with all of the people supporting Donald Trump today. And also happening today in Council Bluffs, a few Iowa leaders were in town, including the attorney general. We're going to have more on that side of the story coming up tonight at 6. John.